It's about time that fairy tale had come to a close for now. But until then, we still have posters of Davis, Astrid, Akat, Taro, and Vitalis on my Teespring store below. Why don't y'all spend your money on my crap instead of the Starbucks stuff that you probably aren't going to be spending on anyways? I don't know. Just give me your money. Please, I request it. See you guys. Before the video starts, I would like to ask that you guys subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell for notifications, leave a comment down below, and like the video. I would heavily appreciate it. Hope you enjoy. The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Wish I could have gotten here sooner. Yeah, it did take us a little bit to get here. Yeah, well, when you don't want to get spotted by humans, probably. I wasn't a good complaining idea. about it. I I know. I just sometimes I hate walking around and just having to hide in shadows. Did enough of that already. So what do we do? Find Brian. I have no idea where he is. Uh, I'll walk down there if you want. We could catch up, I guess. Yeah. I'll check up here. Alright, so... One of two things. You're either downstairs or you're in your office actually doing work for once. <laughs> guess we'll have to see. But maybe we can get those supplies in, yes? Sounds good. Okay, Vindy. Uh, I'll call you back, Vindy. Uh, someone's here. Molten? Brian. Hey, what are you doing here? I need to talk to you. Okay. I was here recently. In your, uh, basement. Whatever you want to call it. Okay. Thought I would give Did our... Something happen? I thought I'd give our mutual friend a visit. Oh, Freddy. Well, whatever's left at this point. I'm still trying to figure out how to contain I, everything, but I I know you're figuring stuff out right now, and this is just a this is just adding on top of the pile of whatever dog crap is happening. But look, I don't know if Freddy's there anymore. I. I wanted to close the book with Springtrap, and it just didn't seem like Freddy was fighting at all. I thought He's I'd tell you. Strong enough. Whatever's left. Yeah. I don't think we're gonna get him back. He kept saying that he's still alive. But I'm not sure if that's a load or not. He is, but... Not much longer. No. Springtrap said, or told me, that he has parts of his code still alive. Like, holding him hostage, practically. I... I don't entirely know what we should do. I thought I could kill him, but... Maybe I should have. Maybe I should still. Are you sure you want to be the one that kills them? <laughs> Freddy or Afton? Both. Afton has caused nothing but pain for this entire corporation, for his entire existence. From the startup down to the bottom. I don't know whether or not I want to kill him, but him planting a bomb in my head, yeah, makes me want to kill him. Wait, what? A bomb? <laughs> Remember when you and Lefty were in that room? And oh. I chased you around. I really forgot about that. 
<laughs> it wasn't by my volition. I think Springtrap knew I was getting too buddy-buddy and had to get some insurance. I don't know what else to do. I mean, I've tried my best, but it won't be enough. You could try asking him. Maybe there's something he'll tell you and not me. You think so? I don't know. He doesn't like me, but you? <laughs> he hates you. He might just try to... What's the word? Rub salt in the wound, reveal too much information. Then again, that is the Afton way, right? I mean... I suppose it is, but... It's not like Springtrap can hurt us if we kill him. <sighs> yeah. We don't want to lose Freddy permanently afterwards. Or the original, anyways. Where is she? Where's who? I... I brought Baby along with me. Oh, baby's hey! Here. Uh, I kinda got distracted playing on stage. You did? Well, yeah. I kind of, yeah, it, it, I'm sorry. But hi, Brian. Oh, hey, baby. How's everything going? Um, I mean, good. That's I good. I'm going to get things afloat again. Well, I'm right. happy for you. I thought well, you could use some closure. Oh. That makes sense. Uh, come on, we should go to Ted downstairs. You didn't know, did you? Know what? Well, I mean, I guess Afton. The whole Freddy being held captive or whatever. That day when you left me with them, me and Springtrap talked. You did. So, yes, I know about it. <laughs> well, I had a feeling anyways. I did warn him, if he did try to do anything. That my mind wasn't going to be changed like it would be before. <laughs> and I'll have to do what I have to do. You have actually changed, Brian. I know I have. I have a better or worse. Or both. Now, are you ready? This is your show for the most part. Maybe he'll talk to you after we leave. But I want to hear what he has to say to Baby first before I go. Okay, I'm initiating reboot. Firewalls are up. Please deposit five coins. I'm not this stupid. Ready? Hey, hey, Brian. How you doing? Uh, good. I'm still working on how to separate yourself from Springtrap. You are? Still taking some time. Thanks. I, I appreciate that. Look, uh, Molten and, and Baby are here to see you. Hey, <clears throat> it's good to see you. Yeah, well, I'd rather not talk to Molten right now. Why not? Maybe because I talked to his dumbass earlier. Listen, Freddy, I don't know if I'm going to be able to fix you entirely, so you might not have that much time left. <sighs> it's I they don't waste them. fine, Brian. Told you. What about baby? What about baby? <laughs> oh yeah, what about me? Yeah, uh, funny. Yeah, what about me? Don't you want to say something? Say what? There's nothing to say to her. So the... The unconditional love you had is now just kind of fizzled out. What is there to say to you? You kind of betrayed me. 
I, I was really gonna turn didn't. us back to humans. I I didn't do anything. Wait, I was wait, not. Wait, wait. Spring trap. Man, you really are thick in the head, aren't you? Oh, well, Freddy, where's the... I put the firewalls up. I told you, his code's not really there much. Your firewall can only last so long, Brian, and it's been what? A month? Maybe two? I have a lot of time in here. No, you don't actually. <laughs> because if I don't find a way to fix Freddy, then you're gonna go away. Really? Not even hold not even if I hold him hostage. Here, I'll let him talk to you real quick if you want. <laughs> I can't move my damn legs, Brian. He's really keeping me down. But I, I need to just kill. No, no, no. They're done now. Baby. Let's get this out of the way first. Huh? Okay, yeah. This appointment this out. out of the room and all that. Yeah. What do you want, Squirt? I don't know. I wanted to see if, what, what you felt after all this time. Your mother and I, all of us, together, we could have been more family. It's not my fault you failed. I didn't have any... We would have gotten a second chance, you moron! I didn't have anything to do with any of this. You did all that without asking me. She's right. You did. You were the selfish one, the whole thing, aren't you? Call me selfish, I don't care. I did what I wanted for my family. What, Brian? Some lasting remarks? One last quip? Look at the way you're talking to your own daughter. She's not my daughter. Uh, well, actually I am, but okay. No. Elizabeth is your daughter. Not anymore. You've done so much wrong to her. Okay, Nothing you can't wrong. disown me. We've already disowned you. Like, a way long ago. You're late to the punch here. <laughs> That's true. Well, I don't care if it's late or not. Three well, months have passed for me, me while I, quit. I was gone. That's what you just did. Don't you see, Springtrap? You're all alone. You have no one. Oh, Brian, you think I have nobody? I have a couple tricks left up my sleeve. Maybe you should check up on your friends a bit more often. What does that mean? Oh, I would go into more detail, but I don't want you ruining the fun. No, I want to play some mind games with Brian. Why? It's not that fun. What are you talking about? It's fun for me. Yeah, because you have nothing else to do. God. Yeah. Get out. If it's about nightmare coming in here the other day, I already know about that. No, I don't care about that. Then what? I want those two out. Alright. Fine <laughs> really? by me. I got my closure. Is that it? Really? That can't be it. <laughs> yeah, you can tell my horrible wife she can go kill herself too. She really doesn't care about you, but all right, pop off. Your I life guess. is in my hands right now, and this is how you choose to deal with it. Oh, Brian, we have so much to talk about. Do we? Yeah. Let's just get going, calling baby. Yeah. Thanks, Brian. I'd ask about the uh, other person you have trapped, but maybe another time. Danny? Yeah. There's a reason why they're in there. <laughs> Imagine it's not any good one. No, it's not. Good luck. Thanks. He's gonna need it. I didn't know. I didn't. I thought your father would be a bit more. No, I figured that would happen. 
You're very optimistic, but I kind of... I don't know. You know. I mean, I'm trying to change my outlook on things. Yeah, I, I thought mean, you after all, the way he talked about you before and Ballora and... I don't know why he's calls me a disappointment. He's the one who did all those plans in the first place, and I had no control or any say in it. If anything, he should be disappointed in himself and not me. Are you alright, baby? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I'm kind of, you know, like, all the stuff that's happened to me, you know? I, I, I'm kind of bulletproof at this point. Emotionally. I'm... I'm here for you if you need it. I will need it. Thanks, man. I appreciate you. Alright. You wanna... Skedaddle, you know? Get out of here. Yeah, let's skedaddle! <laughs> Alright. Good luck, Brian. You certainly will need it.